Let's talk about mounting things to your bike. Hi, my name is Gene Arnold from Regular Guy Mountain Biking, and today I'll be talking about a light mounting solution built by a company called Paul Component Engineering. So this company makes lots of cool different mounting solutions and all kinds of cool products. But today I'll be focusing on this guy. It's called the Stem Cap Light Mount. Though the light I have can mount to the handlebars, um, it just seemed kind of cramped and I was really hoping I could find a better solution and I figured I'd give this a try. So the Stem Cap Light Mount mounts to your bike pretty much where you'd expect it to mounts on your stem and it'll take the place of your standard stem cap you take that off and you replace it with this stem cap and not only does it cap the stem it also offers a new mounting solution for your bike light so I wasn't really sure if I was gonna like the way this mounted on my bike it does mount right in the center on my stem it does raise off the stem a little bit, and I was a little half and half on it, but I figured I'd give it a shot. After attaching it to the bike and mounting my light onto this adapter, I was definitely sold on it, and it did exactly what I was hoping it would do. It got the light off my handlebars and mounted in a new location, um, in this case, on the stem of my bike. It's nice, it really puts the light dead center, um, right, right in the center of your handlebars, it mounts tightly and securely, well the light mounts tightly securely to the stem, um, but it also gets it just high enough over all your cables and everything. So I, I keep saying this, but the handlebars are getting so cramped with uh, dropper seat post buttons and uh, now your suspension can have lockout buttons and all kinds of things. You've got your computer on your handlebars. So real estate on your bars is getting kind of tight. This allows me to take my light and move it off the handlebars onto the stem. And as you can see, it really offers a nice solution for the light uh, and attaches uh, nicely to the bike and the light attaches really nicely to the stem. So at this point, I've only tested this mount with my Bright Eyes um, bike light, but by the way it looks and how most lights mount the handlebars, it really should be good to go with most lights. This specific light attaches to your handlebars uh, or this mount by way of a rubber band that mounts around the bars and attaches tightly to well whatever you're mounting it to uh, the mount the handlebars other bike lights have clamps that go around and you can kind of tighten them up regardless they're pretty much designed for the same diameter of what a handlebar would be i don't really see why any light that mounts to a handlebar wouldn't work great on on this stem all in all, I'm really pleased with the quality of this product. I chose to get the, uh, the black powder coated one. They also have a gray one. Uh, my bike's black, so it looks nice and uh, it matches the bike. But the build quality is really nice. It's got Paul engraved on the side. It's built in the United States. Uh, it's solid. Um, I mean, there's not really too much more to get into about this. It comes with the bolt to attach it to the stem. Everything's clean and well, it does exactly what I was hoping it would do. It takes the light off the handlebars and puts it in a new location on the stem. Uh, no complaints. Happy with the product. It does exactly what it was supposed to do. Now, Paul Component Engineering makes a whole slew of other different adapters that can mount onto your bike. Um, GoPro adapters that can be attached to the stem and other areas of your bike. Uh, they make a whole bunch of things, so it's definitely worth your time to go over to their website and check them out and see what they have. Um, it's not just this one specific stem mount that I've purchased. Um, they make lots of cool things, so definitely head over to their website and see what they've got. So I hope you found this review helpful, and as always, I thank you for tuning in, and I guess I'll, I'll talk to you next time. Have a good one, folks.